So, after sleeping in the car park, I'm still here at Kempton to open the day in his race 14 for a two mile five furlong Lanzarote handicap hurdle. Theory of everything for Joshua Sutherland's a top weight gold top for Pontypool Racing, Rivera Alta for Darren Thompson, Ozark Bridal for Vinnie Gerard, Ban the Bum for Kevin Meenahan, Reckoner for Alex Cherry, Tower Maximus for Paul Rhodes, Dante for Martin Needham, Henry Crime for James Shea, Chuckle Vision for Pontypool Racing, Sablatso Trouble for Alex Cherry, and Spars Corner for James Shea makes up 12. For the lands are already handicap hurdle. They're racing. Here at Kempton. First, day two, the gate. As we wait for it to settle down, approach the first of the nine hurdles. There's Chuckle Vision that led us over it, but stepped a little bit. No theory of everything. Chuckle Vision takes it back up again. So it's going to be Chuckle Vision for Grand Clutterbuck. It's going to lead them down to the second flight. And these by about two from the slump. So that's so trouble on the outside. If you're pushing through here, they're still trying to settle down and get into a better order. And it's Chuckle Vision that leads, comes over towards the fence now as they swing right at it. So it's Chuckle Vision from Dante in the purple cells, although taking a keen hold up against the fence here in the green suits, red cap is Envy Crime for James Shea. Between those is Tower Maximus for Paul Rhodes. We've got a theory of everything. Widest, further wider still, a ban the buns of that so trouble. Widest of all is Ozark Bridal. Number three. Rivera out to Reckner and Gold Topper together. And just a little is James Shea's other runner, Spars Corner. But it's Chuckle Vision that still leads. By just a length, but reluctantly. As it goes through the first half a mile, it's Chuckle Vision that leads him over the second. We'll take that and the slower jumps towards the rear, but Chuckle Vision still leads. If we come to the third, which will be the last next time round. Chuckle Vision that leads us over. It's been, been joined now by Ban the Bun. And that's a black so trouble and Dante a little bit wider. Towards the fences, Emery Prime Tower, Maximus, Ozark Bridal, still widest of all, in theory of everything. The Reckoner, the Vera out up against the fence, and Baron Thompson Silks, Cerise, White Sleeves. And then wider still is Gold Top, Ray Clutterbuck, Sparse Corner still at the rear. But up front, Ban the Bun's taken on Chuckle Vision now, just noses in front, he's too happy to go along together. Band the bun and chuckle vision. They've got about three length of branch from Dante as we go to third on his own. As he gets to the full third up, it's band the bun and chuckle vision. About four to Dante. He skips over that well. Towards the rear, gold top, stepped over it a little bit. But band the bun's just taken out by half a length now, so band the bun and chuckle vision. By about four now. To Dante who's slipped back into the chasing main chasing pack. Still out wide here is Ozark Bridal. Get over that particularly well. Now that it's Spar's corner, and we're starting to lose sight and get a little bit disconnected at the rear. But it's Ban the Bump and Chuckle Vision still. It's two lead. Ban the Bump for Kevin Meenham is second race of the season. Happy to lead Chuckle Vision. And about three back now to Henry Prime, who's moving to third. Dante up against the fence. And the theory of everything Tower and Maximus, the two Alex Jerry horses, is black, so trouble and the reckoner together. Still widest of all is Ozark Bridal. Billy Gerard, and then that Rivera Alta and Gold Top, we can say, from the losing Spars corner at the moment. As they start to get a little bit more single file now as we come inside the final mile. Still ban the bun that leads, but Chuckle Vision's being joined by Emery Prime into second now. Dante's moving forward, Tower and Maximus, the theory of everything. So ban the bun being joined by Emery Prime as they get to the next. Just going to be three from home. It's ban the bun and Henry Prime. These two now lead from Chuckle Vision, Dante, Tower, and Maximus. Theory of everything. Oh, and those up right went. I think Tower and Maximus went through the straight through the top of that, slipped on landing, lucky to hold on to his jockey. But it's ban the bun that still leads. He's got the row to help as he come inside the six. So it's ban the bun and Henry Prime. Theory of everything, make it a move now. So Black So Trouble's still a little bit wide. Ozark Bridal, Tower of Maximus, Chuckle Vision's just starting to go backwards now, and Dante being pushed through. So Ban the Bun is challenged now by Henry Crime. Theory of everything on his outside. Tower of Maximus is still there. Dante, so Black So Trouble. Coming back at him is Chuckle Vision. Still widest of all is Ozark Bridal. Not a lot of them got into this, but it's Henry Crime that leads. On the wide outside, here comes Tower of Maximus to throw down the challenge, and it's Henry Crime.
line. Tyra Maximus, Dante Wider, still theory of everything. They're all under a lot of pressure now as we come inside the three, which is two to jump. It's Henry Crime from Tyra Maximus and Dante. Theory of everything. Ozark Bridal still trying to run on. Here comes Ribera Outer from nowhere. Chuckle Vision still going backwards. But it's Henry Crime that's still the one they've got to catch as they come and find a quarter mile. It's Henry Crime from Dante who didn't get over it particularly well. Theory of everything trying to make up the ground on the outside. Tyra Maximus up against the fence. But it's Henry Crime who's going to be challenged now by Theory of everything as they get down to the last and furlong to run. Dante Chuckle Vision. But it's Henry Crime giving way to Theory of everything now. Chuckle Vision is trying back into this race. But it's Theory of everything from Henry Crime and Chuckle Vision. Theory of everything is holding off everybody here. Theory of everything is another win here for Josh Sutherland from Chuckle Vision in second. Henry Crime is third with Bearer out to up for fourth. So the two Kempton races. Last night's final race goes to Josh Sutherland. The start of day two also goes to Josh Sutherland with the Lanzarote handicap hurdle. Theory of everything. Chuckle Vision for Grey Cross Belt was second. Henry Crime for James Shea was third. Ribera out of Aaron Thompson was fourth. And Dante for Martin Leadham was fifth. Hardly got to mention. I'll hand you over to Martin who's over at Ascot.